Well, new developments in a defamation case against the president as the Justice Department signals its intent to intervene. One America's Ethan Viveros has the latest on that court of battle. It's a bombshell from the Justice Department. It, along with Attorney General William Barr, are seeking to assume the role of the president's defense team in a defamation suit filed by journalist E. Jean Carroll. Carroll filed the lawsuit in 2019 after the president publicly denied accusations he sexually assaulted her at a luxury department store in the 90s. In fact, the president denies ever meeting her, and his denial is what initially triggered the lawsuit. It's a totally false accusation. I have absolutely no idea who she is. I, there's some picture where we're shaking hands. It looks like at some kind of event. I have my coat on. I have my wife standing next to me. And I didn't know her husband, but he was a newscaster. But I have no idea who she is. Now the Justice Department wants to step in after a court ruling in August would have required the president to turn over DNA evidence in the case. In a court filing Tuesday, the department says President Trump denied Carroll's accusations while acting in his official capacity as commander-in-chief. Therefore, government attorneys should take over as his defense team. The DOJ is also asking to redesignate the defendant in the case from President Trump to the United States. And since federal officials are mostly immune to defamation charges, the redesignation would render the suit completely void, should the DOJ's filing prove successful. Barr touched on the matter during a briefing Wednesday. This has to do with something called the Westfall Act. That is an act that provides that when tort cases, state tort cases are brought against uh, government employees in the executive branch and in the legislative branch, and the tort was allegedly committed in the course of federal employment, the case can be certified for shifting to the federal courts and the United States can be substituted as the responsible party. That The Westfall Act applies to claims against the president, the vice president, as well as other federal employees and members of Congress. There is case law in D.C. Uh, it, it has been invoked uh, by previous presidents, including uh, most recently uh, Bush 43, uh, Vice President Cheney, President Obama, and now President Trump. Carroll initially responded to the report in a string of tweets Tuesday, saying the president has hurled Bill Barr at her, calling the move unprecedented. She suggested the White House is attempting to silence her, but welcomed the DOJ's filing, saying, quote, bring it. Ethan Viveros, One American News. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One American News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One American News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.